everybody, this is your tarot and numerology forecast for Tuesday the 25th of November 2014. Let's have a look at what's coming up today. Wow, I am so glad I bought this deck. It's called the Tarot of the Animal Lords and I love it. I think it's amazing. A card with two dolphins dancing, for me, that really, that's, that's enough. I don't need any more than that and I love that. The first card is the stars, okay? And the stars um, isn't so much the... Mm, well, is it the star? The star is the 17th card of the Major Arcana, so this is the star, okay? But they're representing it almost like judgment, where you're getting balance and you're um, balancing things out. But what this means is to have hope for the future, to detox of any negativity. Yesterday there was some conflict in your life. Make sure you take some time for yourself to just let go of that negative energy. Don't carry around any resentment or anything like that. Um, and just get in touch with your fun side and have hope that things will be fun again in future. So in the morning, take some time to let go of any negativity. The next card is the Ace of Pentacles. And I don't know why this blue bird is the Ace of Pentacles. Do you have any idea? The Ace of Pentacles is a blessing from the universe. It The universe says, we're going to pay for this. So expect some, expect a free lunch, a free meal, a check in the post, expect uh, a rebate on your course fees, expect the lawyer to say, you don't have to charge me, for, uh, you don't have to pay for the last one that was pro bono, anything like that, expect a financial blessing. And then finally, the world. And the world is the completion of everything. It, the major arcana goes from 1, well, 0, the fall, to 21. And it's the culmination of all your experience. And it means that you are in touch with the world. You are in touch with your spiritual truth. You refine your sense of fun, your soul. You find um that even though finances are important, you don't depend on them for your good. The universe is where your good comes from. And you feel completely at one with the universe. That's amazing. That's like a day of enlightenment. That's a real breakthrough. That's real freedom. This reading is real freedom. It's not having enough money to buy a wonderful house. It's this feeling of complete integration with your spirit, your soul, this universe we all inhabit. It's a feeling of belonging and being in exactly at the right place at the right time. It's one of those awakened moments. So really embrace that and own that and love it. 17 and 1 is 18. 18 and 21. Oh dear. 18 and 21. So um, 21, 31, 39. 3 and 9 is 12, right? 9 and 3 is 12. Yeah. Yeah. No. I'm having major issues counting today. 9 and 3 is 12. I th yeah, that's right. Okay. Uh, 12 is 1 and 2 is 3. And 3 is expression. So express your joy. Other people will be... Uh, it'll be contagious. The more you express your joy and your bliss and your serenity, the more life will... Uh, express it back. So for instance, you're so happy, you walk into your restaurant and because you're so happy and because you're such a wonderful addition to the restaurant and you walk in there with your smiling face, the manager says, Do you know, we like these people. They've come here two or three times. They're always so happy, cheerful. I'm going to comp their meal today and give it to them free of charge. That's the kind of thing I'm talking about. Have a fantastic day. If you'd like a private reading with me, please get in touch via my website. It's gregoryscott.com or send me an email, readings at gregoryscott.co.uk and remember to subscribe to this channel. Have a... Oh, and tell me what you think of these cards because I adore them. I think both of them are amazing. So have a wonderful day and I'll be with you again tomorrow. I'm using the Radiant Rider Weight deck for this reading. Let's see what's coming up. Okay, 